What is up guys, Vincent back with some more Witcher 3. As you recall in the last video, we had finished up with um, uh, White Orchard, which is one of, is the, um, the main area for the, uh, for the, um, basically the beginning of the game. It's like, um, not the beginning of the game, but like the, the intro of the game. There we go. Um, there is some Arania right here so I'm gonna go ahead and pick this Whoa. up real quick but yeah so we went ahead and uh, finished up White Orchard took care of the oh that's hand fiber not Arania um, we took care of the Griffin did the side missions got the Viper um, um, cat or Viper Viper school gear which is the Viper steel sword and the Viper silver sword which are basically swords that have a poison base to it and they're the best swords you could pretty much have at the moment at this level in the game and where I am at in the storyline um we also had gotten our dope ass Tamirian armor which looks pretty damn good if you do if you ask me and um we made it to Vizima with um Yennefer to talk about Ciri which is our goddaughter um if you don't recall from the tutorial of the game we were at the Witcher um castle She's a little girl that we were training with the white hair. Um, she's not so little no more, but that was like a flashback slash dream anyways. But so now we're in Velen, um, after we talked to um the king basically, the leader of the Nilf Guardians. Um and what's his name? I forgot what his name is. Um this is why it's good that they have a glossary. So let's see. Um Emir of our Emery's, there we go. So we talked to him. And he's basically a dickhead, doesn't really like us, but he wants to find his daughter. And he knows that the wild hunts after them. So we're going to go ahead and um, help him out, find Siri. Um, we're not really doing it for him, even though he is going to pay us. Um, so, yeah. Um, oh, and that's what Siri looks like now. So we haven't really got to that point in the game yet, but so that's a little spoiler, I guess. But, um, yeah, so we talked to him, and they went back and talked to Yennefer for, for the last time, and she said she was going to go to Skellige, because there was a big old explosion of magic that happened there or something. But, anyways, um, so she went to Skellige, she told me that there was leads of her in Velen and in Novigrad, so that's why I'm here in Velen now. And that's pretty much where we left off. Um, one thing I did forget to do is I did level up, so we did not put that point on yet, so we're going to go ahead and put the point on, and we did unlock um this new spot so what we're going to do um we could do our strength training what is this arrow deflection flex arrows while parrying that could be cool lightning reflex time slow by initial 50 percent while aiming with a crossbow i don't really use crossbows general Adrenaline points loss upon taking damage is lowered by 20%. I don't really care about that either. I think I'm just going to go strength training. Um, oh, shit. No. What the hell am I doing? Um, increased potion over dose. That could be really good. Well, I mean, bombs. That could actually be pretty helpful because bombs are kind of hard to aim sometimes. Every known level 1 alchemy formula increases max toxicity by 1. That's pretty dope, actually. But I'm... I mean, that's not really going to help too much because there's not too many level 1 formulas. If toxicity is above 0, time automatically slows when an enemy is about to perform a counterattack. Oh, that's pretty fucking badass, actually. That's pretty sick. Um, But for now... Why does it keep doing that? I, I wish... Like, the buttons are so weird in this game sometimes. Right now we're just going to do our strong attack because we haven't put anything on our strong attack. So our strong attack is kind of weak. So we're just going to go ahead and do that. And we're going to put that there. And I don't think we have a red mutagen. Is this a red mutagen? That's vitality. Fuck. Alright. I want to make... I want a red mutagen because that'll help a lot right here. It'll make my attack power like plus 10% or some shit. Um, but anyways, a little catch up after all that, after I, you know, for those of you who weren't in the last few episodes, um, I pretty much told you guys everything that happened. So we're leveling up four now, we got our gear, we got our Tamirian gear, and we got our Viper Steel Sword and, and Silver Sword. Um, another thing I did is I went back to 
um, to White Orchard and did all the rest of the stuff that I said I would do um, off camera or off recording. So as you could see, we hit these three spots that were up here. That it was hidden treasure, a hidden treasure, and abandoned camp. Um, right here, I found a quest for some dude that was like, or for like a. This quest led me to this bandit camp, basically, and they had treasure, um, but they were stealing from people and stuff, they were just bandits, and then right here, there was another little quest that I somehow randomly found, like, I didn't find the, the thing that started that quest, um, and I did, um, and I went and followed all these ro roads, because I've never done that before, and I wanted to see where they went, um, but they actually just cut off, so, like, once you get to, like, the edge around this area, it just says that it's the end of the world, um, same thing over here once you hit like right here it says it's the end of the world right here once you hit about right here it's the end of the world and then up here like literally stops like right here somewhere so so these basically you can't even go past anything but anyway so yeah we caught up on all that um so now we just need to continue on and um get on with our stuff so i do know there is a little town right in front of me right here with a notice board so we're gonna go ahead and hit that town hit that notice board um there's some dogs right here i do want to take care of real quick but yeah we're gonna, so we're gonna go ahead and do that um because that's gonna give us a bunch of quests and stuff so let's go ahead and do that real quick i do want to take care of these dogs real quick though and these dogs are here every single time so and they're level one so it's not really Boop. Boop. Hey bitches, y'all can calm down. Jesus, dude, when they're in a fucking pack, it's like I can't even do anything. Dogs are the most annoying. Honestly, dogs and wolves are the most annoying fucking enemies in this entire game. I'm not even gonna lie. They dodge your attacks really good. When they're in packs, you just get fucking stampeded by them, basically. It's like, oh, here's an attack, here's an attack, here's another attack. It's fucking, yeah. It's ridiculous. But anyway, so let's head over here and hit this. Um, what's this say? The Nilfgaardian Court Martial has found this man guilty of the crime of desertion. Committed when he abandoned his weapon and dishonorable, dishonorably fled the field of battle. As per the dick of the Nilfgaardian military codex he's been sentenced to death by hanging may his name fall into oblivion for all of time that's fucked up kinda that's pretty fucked up like like what if they were getting swamped or something like he was just supposed to fucking stay and fight like the fuck nah dude put your sword away bro Put your sword away, bro. Fuck. Okay, so we found Mulbradale. What the fuck are you talking about, bitch? I'm gonna steal your youngins? I, I fucking save youngins. And there's the notice board sign. Okay. God, this lighting is kind of shitty. Like, it looks cool, but it's kind of shitty. Is there nothing I can... Start? What the fuck? I would like to search. Yo, shit. Can I search this shit? What the fuck? Oh, there's a broken door right here. What the fuck, man? Get out my way. Alright. What the fuck, dude? Jesus Christ. Um, hello? There's like a whole thing down here. Alright, alright. Oh, shit. Ooh, we got another crossbow. What the fuck? Awesome. Enhanced cat. Oh, I haven't even fucking done the first cat. Brother Albert's bestiary. Each beast herein described in two manners ye may hunt. Either seek ye tracks, follow the strike, the foulness, wherever it is, 
while you find it or lure it to a chosen place and engage it there in advantageous battle. The latter poses less risk, but the hunter exposes no chance for an unexpected fight. Note, however, not that to lure a beast into a trap versus its tastes and behaviors ye must know. As for fork tails, bait them thusly, pound a stake into the soil, bind a goat to it, then hide ye in near to shrubbery post haste. The beast lure by the caprine odor will without fail soon come. It is a griffin ye seek to slay. Take ye buckthorn from deep water. The mighty stench of the herb is to griffins like fresh roasted meat of the primest sort. And so come they will forth with, though far away they might be, turning to drowners and water hags, it is known to all and sundry that fish and rotting mollusks are their loves, and as for trolls, common hooch is their weakness. Oh. So I just got shit about trolls and stuff about forktails, maybe? The Wonders of Zedekania. And an empty bottle. Okay. Got it. Got a few things, not bad. Not bad. Is there anything else around here? Alright, here's the notice board. Let's go ahead and... A warning! Help us send him off. Darlin on Sid. On Shade. That's how you say it, it's Shid. Shade. I don't know why it's like that, but it's like that. Notice, guide wanted, and a missing wife. Good people, will take pity and hear my plea. My wife, Hannah, she's missing. A few days ago, she went into the woods and hasn't yet returned. I'm near out of my wits with worry and will pay any price to the man who brings her back to me, or at least tells me where to look for her. Neelan Hunter from Blackbow. So, got discovered locations. Got a new mission. Alright, let's see. Let's go up in here and see if we can steal anything. And that shit's locked, so I guess not. Gods. Full moon soon. Bow your windows tight. Nail an iron shed in the door. Got some shit right here. Some alchemist powder. Alcoholist. It's a little building over here. I'm gonna go in and search. Somebody nicknamed Dolan. Well that sucks. There's nothing in here? Wow, I have not found very too many bu buildings that don't have anything in them. Uh, we got a pretty big looking house right here. Oh no, this is two houses. Okay. Um, what up, grass? Well, we got this one right here, so we can we might as well search this up real quick and. Oh. It's a grindstone and a bench. I never knew that was there. That is locked, so we can't do shit there. Let's run over here real quick. There's a door we can come in right here. Uh, we got... What is this? Search that. Why can't I search that? That's weird. It's like the only thing in here. Why do they... I don't get why they would... Like, why? Why make it glow if I can't search it? Don't you look at me. Man, fuck off. I'll look at who the fuck I want to look at, homie. <laughs> okay, so we got the signpost from Mobile Dale right here. Oh, got some stuff in here. A rusty bread knife. Awesome. A mug. That's about it. Ain't really shit in this area. Man. That place in freaking White Orchard. Or White Orchard, actually. That's what it's called. The town is actually called White Orchard, also. Had way more shit than this fucking place does. The fuck? I'm sorry. I'm just trying to get in this, this house. What's this? Earth elemental decoction? Damn. Bunch of good shit in there. Some flowers. Got some shit over here. Eh. 
the chest right here. I need to search it. And it didn't have shit in it. Alright, come on, Geralt. We can get through this. Let's go. Nice. Okay. And then there's this house right here. With stuff in the front I can actually loot. Like, wow, I'm surprised. Bunch of shit, dude. Some cheese, some water. Bunch of good stuff right here. Shenanakins. We got another house right here. My bad, guys. You guys are probably like, man, get into some shit already. I know. You have to search in this game, though. That's how you make money. Oh, and I went and sold a bunch of shit. Like, all the stuff I went and got from those camps and stuff in, uh... Um, in White Orchard, I went and sold. So I, now I have like a good 800 coin again after, remember I had like no coin after I bought the armor from that guy. He done took like all my coin. Oh, what's over here? I knew there was something up. I was like, ooh, dimeridium ingots. It's a very good metal. It's one of the, for the, some of the highest type of gear you can get in the game is what you need that for all right so this is this last house that I'm gonna go into um oh there's quite a bit of things in here a doll that's kind of creepy okay black magic doll why is there a mug in there why is there not like good shit in there it's a chest there's better shit in these fucking bags Alright, so we got a bag right here with a candle in it. Black magic doll, a regular doll. Creepy as shit, people. Uh, water. That's locked. Huh, that's kind of weird. And actually, there is this building right here I forgot about also. Anything in here? Some orange puffball. That looks like about it. So I think that's about it for a uh, Mulberdale. Um, yeah. Got some question marks over here now. So we could go around. And uh, do some shit around here if we wanted to. But, um, yeah, that would uh, take forever. So we need to go ahead and look at our quest real quick. Some quests might be too difficult for you at the moment. Each quest is just a level shown next to its name. Once your character reaches that level, you're ready to take on that quest. Mm. You could be a couple, like maybe two or three levels lower depending on your gear. Maybe even five. Maybe, I would say five at the max on the on the difficulty that I have. But anyway, so we got Pyres and Overgrad. Visit Triss. Enough Guardian Connection. We need to go to the end of the crossroads and talk to the dude. We have Wild at Heart. And we have Wind Steppen's unique card. Okay. Well, I guess we're just going to do this. So we're going to go to the innkeep at the... At the crossroads, I want to go ahead and meditate so that it's not like dark outside. Roach, why did you why why would you pop up on the other side of the fence? Oh what the hell? There's like a whole graveyard right here. Get up. Let's check this out real quick. Come on, Roach. I've never seen this. Slow now. Whoa. 
I've never Give seen this little. This, I've played this game like two or three times through. Well, like two Christ. times through. I played it like twice through. Which is saying something. Because if I'm playing it again and making videos this time, that means it's it's a good. Come like on that's, now. that's how you know it's a good game. Am I going the right way? Is this really telling me to go the right way? Okay. Let's go. What is this? Whoa there, Roach. Oh, there's a. A mission. Priest of Eternal Fire, what's up, dude? What do you want? Rejoice, for even a creature as depraved and base in nature as you can serve the glory of the eternal fire. Someone must see to the corpses on the battlefield. Necrophages defile those not already rotting in mass graves. This is not right. That's to be my good deed for the day. A handsomely profitable one, I might add. I know your kind don't work for free. You damn right, son. Uh, I'll do it. Fuck it. All right. I'll take care of it. This will count amongst your merits. The more good one works in life, the more hallowed things are. Yes. Splendid. Here are the holy oils. Dash generously and set alight. Understood? I wish it to flare up to the sky. For the glory of the eternal fire and all that. Once I've incinerated the body, and all that, find you. I shall be near the bridge to Novigrad. Okay. You kind of seem like sketch, bro. Like, and all he's like, yeah, praise the eternal fire and all that. Like, he didn't even give a fuck. Like, that's the thing about priests and shit. Like, priests are always so up, uptight, stuck up pricks. Like, and they're supposed to be like. God, dude, this weather is horrible. I can't see shit. If I don't recall, I remember there... Is this it? Oh, it is. There's a quest mark right here. Yes. A dude getting attacked. I remember. Alright, we need to use Igni on them. They really don't like it. Done fucked you up, homie. Take that. Come on, quick, unbind me. Well, chill out, bro. John Verdon. The next ones come. When they come, I'll tend to them. Meanwhile, let's you and me chat. Yeah, Let why are you? I'm untying. Exactly. Why are you all tied up? John Verdon served in the Tenth Maribor Division. Long way from your army. The army don't exist no more. Black one smashed it to bits. I scarped off into the woods just before that happened. Join a group of refugees, fucking bursting with patriotism they were. As soon as they learned I'd abandoned Tamaria in her hour of need, they beat me down, tied me up like a turkey, left me to the drowners. Ah, oh, fuck! I'll untie you, dude. Fine, I'll help. Oh, thanks. For a minute there, I was almost sure you'd leave me to die. Well, I'm not that fucked up. Well, I always thank you somehow. I think about but shit. I've got a chip crown to my name. Tough. I'll take the loss. Thanks, Witcher. May you prosper on the path. What the fuck you know about the path, homie? You're just a fucking regular ass dude. Twenty five experience points, huh? I mean it's cool. It's cool, uh... Oh, Blood Moss. I haven't found that yet. It's cool because... Alright, yeah, we're definitely waiting. I can't. This weather is just garbage. But it's cool because it's just like a really quick thing. All I had to do is kill two drowners real quick on the side and then just untie them. I didn't have to go anywhere or do anything. Like, 25 experience points. I'll take it. Alright, that's a little bit. Uh, maybe we should wait one more time. At least meditating doesn't take that long in this game. That's one thing I like. It's just it's real quick and just like boom as soon as you click it. Because you fucking you wait you wait in like Fallout or any any of those like Fallout games or like Skyrim or anything like that. Come on. Your waiting is like Jesus dude. It's stupid. Alright, so when you go this way, holy fuck, there's a bunch of drowners right here. What the fuck's going on right here? 
I get so sidetracked so easily. Can I search this dude? Black magic doll. There's another dude right here. What the fuck? Yo, calm down there, buddy. Y'all really want this shit. Oh my god. Blue. Damn, son. My dude is fucking getting strong. Mind you, this is on the second hardest difficulty right now. I just shot over all those level 4 fucking... Well, I guess I am level 4 now anyways, but... So I guess it's about the right level for my character right now. But I mean, technically it's like I'm fighting level 6 people or some shit because of the fact that I have it on such a hard difficulty at the moment. Because basically the difficulty that I have it on just means that they hit a lot harder. And... means I take a lot more damage. And I don't hit them for as hard. As I would normally. So. Saint, what is this? Is another person hanging right here? This man has been sentenced to death by hanging for the crimes of theft, armed robbery, and rape. May his rotting carcass serve as a warning to other who, others who others who contemplate trespassing the North Guardian Empire's laws. Well, he did rape somebody, so he kind of deserves that. What I want to know is how the fuck did they get him up there? Did they have, like, ladders or some shit that they climbed? Cause that's gonna be shitty trying to hold someone while climbing that fucking tall ass ladder. Uh, hornwort. One second, guys. I'm checking my uh, my messages on my phone. Anyways, what the hell? Didn't I just kill all those motherfuckers? Whatever. Whatever. In at the crossroads. What is this? Missing. Tomorrow, Stranger. Stranger? Stranger? Stringer? I'm gonna say Tomorrow, Stranger. Daughter of the Bloody Baron. Presumed kidnapped. Hardy rewards for whoever finds her or brings her in. Um, okay, so someone's missing. We got some weird looking thing right here. And we need to, alright, I'm gonna search every shit first. Oh, can't go in there. Run to the woods. Wait there till I come get you. Understood? Yes, da. Go, quick, now. What the hell? I kind of want to follow that chick, but I think she's like gone. Wait, where did she go? She ran this way. She said, he said run to the woods. This is the only woods area. Oh wait, did I see somebody over here? No? I thought I did. Um, R and R. Nope, hand fiber. I wonder what that was about. Huh. Oh well. So we need to go to the inn, which is right, is that big building right there. Um, I want to look around first, though. 
Oh shit. I didn't realize I can come here. 